My mom's goal in life, even though she struggled with her substance problems, she never forgot her kids. She always used to say in Spanish, I just want to live long enough so that I can see one of my children graduate from high school. Nobody had been out of high school at that time. Nobody. And my brothers and I failed. We all dropped out. We were all street kids. We ran the streets. The change for me was the Army. And when I was 17, I enlisted. I went to uh, basic uh, infantry training and then jump school. I applied for special forces. I couldn't get in because they don't take high school dropouts. So I got a GED. Then I got special forces. Then it changed my life. <clears throat> so the reason I'm telling you this will be apparent in a minute. I went to Vietnam. I fought. I lost a lot of good friends over there. I was wounded myself. I'm a disabled veteran. I came home, and all my special forces friends wanted me to go to college. They said, because I was a special forces medic, a weapon specialist. They said, you should go to college, Carmona. You got potential. I was, the truth was, I was afraid. Because I knew if I applied, I'd be rejected because I didn't do SATs or BSATs and they didn't really have a transcript because I'd been a truant for so long. So one day I filled out the application and I sent it in and showed all my teammates the application so they'd get off my back. And as predicted, I got rejected from every school I applied to, except one. And it was Bronx Community College that said, you're accepted. We have a special program for Vietnam veterans and you don't have to have a transcript. That was my dream act, okay? Because without that program that opened the door to a kid who had potential, with no education and no tangible skills other than what I learned in the military, I couldn't be here speaking to you today to be thought of as a senator from Arizona. I could not have been Surgeon General of the United States. I couldn't have graduated number one in my class in medical school at the University of California. I couldn't have graduated at the top of my class in college. So I understand the importance of the DREAM Act. It's a different DREAM Act today, but it's the same issue. It's giving youngsters opportunity to realize their full potential. And I am thoroughly committed to that because of my own experience and my two brothers and, sis and my sister, all of us who failed the first time, but got second chances because of special programs that gave us opportunity. My brother went on a served in the United States Army for 30 years, okay, in Special Forces. And he was a nurse, a paramedic, a teacher, he's worked with the government, he speaks Spanish, he speaks Arabic, he speaks Russian fluently, okay? He was a high school dropout, okay? So we had our Dream Act. The Dream Act, to me, <coughs> is essential because if you look at all these youngsters, some of whom are here tonight, it is incumbent upon society, it's our responsibility to determine, are they going to become an asset to society or a liability to yep. society? Right. We have the power to make that decision. If we ignore it because of crazy, crazy radicalism that says, go out and get a job, we lose. If we're smart, if we're smart businessmen, forget about even the heart that you feel, the emotion that we have the responsibility. I can make the business case for you. It's a lot cheaper to spend that money up front and make sure the kid gets educated. And you know what? Then they become a taxpayer. So look at it cold -heartedly. It's not even about doing the right thing. They basically become taxpayers. And you know, one of those kids is going to be the next great idea. One of those kids may even be Surgeon General or a U.S. Senator in the future. That's the importance of the Dream Act. It's about what our nation is all about. Because my Aurelita came here, like many of your Aurelitas and your Aurelos, because there was a chance for opportunities, aspirations way beyond anything you could dream of that you couldn't get in the old country, but you could get here.